Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Hollywood Shono here, bringing you another Injustice Gods Among Us video. Now, the last time I tried fighting Bane, he royally kicked all of our asses. So, we are going to try again. We are going to use the same team, since it's a high damage team, for the cast of characters that I have. And we are going to keep trying this fight until I can beat it. Begin. Because... <laughs> Main importance is try to get Bane down as quickly as possible. Don't let him one-shot your teammates, which is very, very possible. And try to get the lesser guys out quickly, but don't let them overwhelm you with damage. Anything with power drain obviously helps. I just got power drain again to me. Anything to cut damage. Watch for attacks. Don't get too aggressive until you get an opening. As you can see, I just got power cards again. Now, the importance is each of my characters has one bar, and there is Bane. So, pretty safe to say. And even with a block, you saw the ridiculous damage that did. So, that's pretty much a one shot kill, which means you need to really put the hurting on him quick and try to have some power drain abilities. Great slam, almost a one hit kill, not quite. So basically here it's try to do as much damage as you can because you know you're going to get destroyed. Try to take the hit. And as you can see, both of the other guys have two bars. Since he's not using a special, trying to get some more damage on Bane. And there's the Venom Uppercut, so now he is down. And he is out of the fight. But Venom Blast takes him out, so... As you can see, you need to significantly level up, because this fight is very difficult. And since that ended so quickly, I'm actually going to try to edit my team and try to get a little power drain in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring in Green Arrow. Green Arrow. I'm going to bring in Nightwing. Nightwing. And I'm going to bring in Lex Luthor, who have a bunch of power Lex drain, Luthor. which you need to stop Bane from doing his ridiculously overpowered attacks. So power drain is very, very important. So we are going to try one more fight since that one ended so quickly. And hopefully we can get him down. Begin. The important thing, obviously, is... <clears throat> Get the lesser guys out first. Try to get Bane in there. Save your power drain, because that is going to come in handy. And Green Arrow is going to use his own power drain. And basically that just stops him from building his combo up, which is important. Now Bane is in, and he's almost got two, so one shot power drain, get another power drain out, you got to get his power down, you cannot let him get any of his special attacks off, but don't obviously let him melee you, because that's going to hurt just as bad, and it's going to be a slow process. This Blocking obviously helps. Unless he does the same and block attack. But you have to keep his power down. Don't let him get those moves off. Don't let him even attack you if you can help it because he hurts. And you got another power gain, so he's got one bar. But power drain stops him from doing that. And we're going to power drain him some more. That was not a good shot. I can't find that. Basically, you want a lot of power drain so you can't get anything off. Now we're actually going to use a level 2. Because we need to get his damage down, but blocking, and even still 404 damage, is a significant amount. You want to block his electric arrow. Now you need to try to put a hurting on the lesser guys, get them out. Try to make sure they don't do as much damage as possible. So then you switch out. Power drain, no special ability. Block the ground sparks. 
Now, actually, we're doing quite well in this fight, and he gets off a ground spark, which is a big ouch. So we're going to try to melee and miss the swipe. Power drain down. He's probably going to get out, but if we can knock him out, that would be even better. Nope, Bane's back in, and he's pretty much dead. So now, power down. Blocking his attack. Do a ridiculous amount of damage as well, and it's pretty much a slow process. You need a lot of power drain. Don't let him get off any of those special moves. Try to block when possible. Stay for a slow wear down process. But if you can get him to not do any special moves, you can probably win this fight. And attack before he gets up. Get him down. And we're going to finish him off right now. Now the next guy comes in, probably going to attack. Block. Watch your attacks very carefully as Bane is down. And as you can see, I barely survived the Savage Blast. But as you can see, Nightwing has a full health bar. So we're going to save his other character because he still half the power drain. Very important. But as you can see, Green Arrow's almost down. Ground Sparks, not a big deal as these guys have very little health. So it should be an easy knockout process. But we're going to get a little aggressive here. And Green Arrow gets his arrow off first, and that is a victory. So it took two attempts, but Bane was defeated. And as you can see, I received the energy card. Two energy cards, 1,730 credits. And Bane is defeated. So really the trick to beating Bane, a lot of power drain, a lot of luck. And you need to block. Make sure... This is your true test, your first true test of ability, so don't falter. And if you like this video of getting past Bane, please give this video a like rating, comment, subscribe, and have a great day, kids.